What is your biggest pet peeve of each other? Would you get jealous if she starts dating someone? Has the thought of you two being a thing crossed your mind? What is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Ray Sien back with another video. Today we have a beautiful special guest right next to me. Would you like to introduce yourself or not? Because I feel like I if you watch me, you should know. You yeah. Know? If you watch Wait. me, you should know. Why are you so red right now? What? Really? You're so red. <laughs> are you blushing right now? No. This whole time I've been talking to y'all cam. Look at you and you look. I was horrible. fine? Right now, Maybe I just get, red. I get stressed. <laughs> You look so red right now, bro. Okay, let me breathe. You're let stressing me, breathe. me out. Look, breathe in, breathe in. Breathe out. Just a bit. You're right. Just almost like potentially 100,000 people watching you right now. Like, okay, no pressure all at eyes all. On you. Picture your whole stadium with 100,000 people, and you're right in the middle. My heart's beating really fast. And basically, they got you on stage. They're like, man, go ahead and introduce yourself. <laughs> Go ahead. It's only a hundred thousand people. Look, 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 look. I would start actually crazy. picture it though. Like, look around. All these people right here. So many people. Go ahead. All right, you guys. If you don't know me, my name is Valeria, aka known as Grandma in the House. I never called you that. Yeah, you never call me Grandma. Yeah, I, I don't, think it's I don't just like. Jaco thing. I don't like the nickname. Yeah, it's just. I don't Why? Know. I like Grandma. Gram I don't like Grandma. You just I'll call you Val, Val or Valsky, yeah. but then I call. Valentina you said Valentina Valsky. Valsky too. Yeah. I call both of Valsky. <laughs> <laughs> you know, anybody, I, anybody, like I just call them like with the K and the I. Yeah, the I school. call you Rayski. Rayski, yeah, it goes with Rayski. It goes with only some names. You yeah, know? they don't know about that life. Um, you were introducing yourself. Well, I'm Valeria Canas. I am. What? You forgot? She's a professional dancer, guys. Oh, yeah. I think that's what she was forgetting <laughs> to say. You I'm professionally a professional dance dancer. Twenty four seven. That's literally her job. Yeah. That's, that's how she makes income. That's what I do for a full time living, yeah. and I do social media on the side just for fun. And yeah, that's about and it. And you've had some big news recently, right? Like, I think, you know, most people probably don't know people that watch me. Do you want to tell them what the big news is, or it's not official yet? Oh, well. Yeah, but like us, like dating and stuff. Oh, so, like, right. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. No, I don't want to say it yet. All right, man. So we can't we can't disclose what the big news are, but not yet, not yet. But she soon. will let you know eventually. All right. Yeah. Today, guys, we went on ahead, and I texted her last night. I was like, "What do you want to eat? Do you have suggestions?" I thought the best thing we could do is eat Colombian food. I personally only had this a few times. I've never had a full course meal at a Colombian restaurant, so it's my first time. Dang. Oh yeah, because you've only had like my mom's stuff. Yeah, your mom's. But that's stuff. not. We went to the restaurant. I, I, I didn't know what to order. I yeah. told her to take over. Yeah, I just didn't. And guys, if you want to see a part two, she's not down. I'm down. I will be down. But you're picky with your food. But I anything, am. What is your point? But if, if, you, wanna you, guys, a, if oh. you guys want to see a part two, I'll do it. I want to do a mug band with her, but Honduran food. You know, I want to put her on since she's putting me on. <laughs> What's so wrong with that? I'm just picky. I'm just picky. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm just a picky eater. Bro. Wait, does does Valentina like her food? Yeah, she does. She does? But is she picky with her food? No, nah, she eats anything. Oh, really? Yeah. How are you picky? What are you picky with? Like, what don't you eat? I don't eat vegetables. Kinda... No vegetables? I don't eat... Mm -mm. Only like spinach and No recipes. vegetables? Mm -mm. That's kind of crazy. I know. You're supposed to eat vegetables. I like, know. I, I know I have to, you, but... You, know? you eat carrots? Mm -mm. You eat corn? Not really, no. Corn is good. It is so you don't good, like corn with mayo? I don't like mayo. Oh my goodness, bro. I don't oh like, my goodness. I don't like sauces. I don't like spicy food. None of that. So like when you go out, let's say you go out on a date with a guy, right? Um, where do you usually go to eat? Or you just don't eat? I, I just prefer not to go on a date to dinner. Bruh. To dinner? At all. No. That's Take literally me. like there isn't I feel like in most scenarios there's not even much I to know, do besides that's take right. a girl to eat. But you can so what do you tell a guy? Movie? You're just like, nah. Okay, movies is boring. I'm gonna keep it real. Yeah, because you can't talk. You can't talk. I feel like you um, want to and you can. You can do like a picnic date. That's cute. And just bring your own food? Yeah, like fruit. I like sushi, so I love we can sushi. do sushi date. You, you like know? ramen? Yeah. I love ramen. Just not spicy ramen. No spicy? No spicy? I don't know. At all. You nothing. don't like hot fries, hot Cheetos, nothing? No, no. Not That's crazy. Actually, let me dig into the food, man, because I'm hungry. It's what time is it? 5 p.m. Uh, what did you order, actually? I got... You got the bandeja paisa. Bandeja paisa. So bandeja paisa has meat, rice, chicharron, avocado, egg. I think this is what asked, right? He asked for scrambled eggs. <laughs> yeah, they laughed at me, bro. I don't know you can't get scrambled eggs at a Colombian restaurant. Yeah, bro. 
Is that but so hard you, to do? Just not enough about that. Please tell me there's still forks. I don't, I don't, I don't, I didn't see a fork there. I don't like, think I hope so. there's a fork there. Please, oh, bro. I don't want back. Okay, look, 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 look. So this is mine right here. Everything that she just said right now. I can't reach over the camera, but this is basically it. This looks fire. Yeah, oh, that really does look good. Look, this is a heat. Is it's there like anything to like dip all of this in? Yeah, that. That's what? your dip. Oh, they do have forks in here. This is dip. <gasps> Yay. Yeah. This is dip. Yeah, it's a heat. What's you can heat? also put your empanadas. Oh, you have Are these both of these one? Or yeah, I like that. Is this salsa roja or what? Um, yeah. What am I supposed to dip in there? Anything you want. Mm. You can Everything? do that. You can do I love it. that they have avocado. You don't see this anymore. Yeah, you don't. And I love this. I love that. And look, your empanadas. Damn, there's a lot of food. Wait, what is this big old dish I think that's right mine. In? What is this? The fish that you got? It might be. Quick interruption guys. I just wanted to say that me and Yero right here, we're in a little mini competition to yeah. see who can make it to 200,000 subscribers first. What should be the wager? You know what I mean? Let's put five bills. Five bills. Five bill guys. Now, but look, look, it's already kind of unfair a little bit because I'm like 23k away and he's like what? Like yeah, bro, 50 I'm, some? I don't know bro. I'm like almost 30,000 subscribers away from you. So yeah, so Big you're like difference. 50 some. Yeah. But Ray gets a lot more views, a lot more people to who who look at his channel. So and I'll be posting more too because I'm taking this serious. I'm gonna post even more now. Ray taking okay. over the world and Jerry gonna follow. Fuck it, Jerry gonna follow. Fuck All it. Man, so if you're Team Ray, you want to see me hit 200,000 subscribers first. Subscribe right now. That's been it for the interruption. We'll get back into the video. Man, subscribe to Ray. Yeah, look, guys, this is the most random Colombian dish it's ever. It's called sachipapa, so it's literally just french fries and just like sausage. Just like chicha in it, bro. That's so random. Colombians are so random. We bro. are, but it's good. You, you can't lie. It's good, bro. This? That doesn't look that good. I'd rather just have fries. What? But y'all did put me on to like hot dogs with, what, piña? Oh yeah. Yeah, that was good. That is pretty good. Okay, yeah, Bro, you know good. what? You know what I want to do here? I want to like squeeze the lemon. Just, you like that? No, do it on yours. But, yours. but um, this would be good too. No, we're sharing. Right, I'll finish this one first. This is my favorite dish ever. So big, like, look, I don't want to spill it because if not, I'm gonna be so mad. But look at that, you guys. <gasps> All right, yes. guys. <clears throat> Today we're doing Colombia food reviews. This has turned from a mug bag to a food review. <laughs> These fries, I give it a one out of ten. <gasps> no. You try. You'll know why. I try it. No. They're so plain, they taste like nothing. Try oh, it. Oh, I'm gonna like that though, because I like plain. Bro, it tastes like nothing though. It's just plain. Oh. Uh, maybe you're supposed to eat it with a salchicha. Maybe. <laughs> right? You're so mad. They're soggy too. Oh my gosh, look at this. What? It tastes like nothing, right? Yeah. They're soggy. It's not supposed oh. to be like that. Alright, fries. Negative. Negative. Um, isn't there supposed to be something to dip this in? Un juguito? That one. Is it this one right here? Mm -hmm. I already had empanadas, so I'm not going to like I've never had this. Yeah, you you like empanadas. I do like it. Oh, I didn't pray. Bro, I was going to tell, tell you that too. I don't know why, I just felt like I was like, should we pray? Because I usually don't, I forget. I was too hungry that I forgot. Damn, you feel guilty right yeah, now? Yeah, I do, I really do. <laughs> You wanna like, do an Allah prayer for both of us? Okay. Heavenly Father God, we thank you for this food. We thank you for the hands that made it. May you protect the hands that made it and send them 10,000 blessings, Lord. Thank May you. this food provide us nutrition and healthy fluids in our body. Amen. Amen. Amen to that. And cheers to this, because this looks really good. You said you could dip this here too? Okay, let's see. Yeah, you can. You can dip whatever, bro. Oh my God. There ain't no rules. No rules with Colombians? Okay, let's see. Chicha on. No crunch? No crunch. I didn't get the crunch part. I got the, the kind of part. Mm. Wow. I'm either really hungry or this is good. It's a good hunt. Mm hmm. 10 out of 10. Obviously, guys, I know what y'all are here for. I know y'all want us to answer a couple questions. So I went on ahead. I put up on my Instagram story for you guys to ask us questions. And by the way, if you don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me right now. That's where I find people for the videos. That's where I get you guys to ask me questions. That's where everything is literally at. So, what are you doing? For so, real? you ready for the first question? I'm ready. Or you want to catch a good bite before we get to the questions first? Because there, there's some uncomfortable questions. Really? Oh, hell. Nah, I don't know. You're going to stress me out. 
<laughs> I was playing. I was playing. They're just questions, bro. Okay. Nothing we can't answer. You know what I mean. We'll start off. We'll start off with the easier questions, yeah. and then we'll lead up to the you know the juicier the juicy. type of questions. All right. Which I really want to hear. First question of the day. They want to know what were our first impressions of each other. Oh, I know this one. What you're gonna say about me? I already told her what I thought about her the first time. It's not a good thing, but. But you can tell people. Since you know what it is mine, I'll tell it after you. Cause I don't think you ever told me yours. I don't think I remember mine. I think the every time I asked you, you're like, I don't have one. LA? Mm-hmm. We met up at a BNB after we got kicked out of We got kicked out of La Casita. Oh, it was that, those apartments, huh? Hmm? Those apartments? That's where you met? Yeah. Yeah, yeah the little BNBs. Not apartments, the Airbnb. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hmm. hmm. No, first time I heard of you was through Valentina, though. Why? Because in the video that we were filming for Jaco, Valentina was there, and then uh, I remember telling Valentina, I was like, Oh, you have a sister. I was like, What's up with your sister? I was, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was just something, because I, I had gone through your gram, but I didn't, I didn't really think much of it. But in the moment, I was just like, What's up with your sister, though? And then she was like, Oh, she's single. She was like, <laughs> <laughs> she, was like she thinks you're cute, by the way. She told me. <gasps> no told way. Me, oh, girl. Wait, my sister has such a big mouth. So, she basically confessed that. So, me, per- think, that's, that's the first time I heard I it. think my first impression of you was just like, oh, okay. Like, that's okay. Jacob's brother. That is not, that's not an impression at all. What are you talking about? Yeah, because we didn't really talk. We didn't, but we made hella TikToks together because it was you and me. Yeah, but I was hella, I was actually so nervous to ask you. I was like, I don't make TikToks with people, so that's weird. I was like, I don't know how to ask him to make a TikTok. Yeah, bro. So, maybe you could say I was like nervous to meet you. We hadn't even had a full on conversation. And homegirl already asked me, she was like, are you done making a TikTok with me? <laughs> and the TikTok was basically a dance. It was a that ended up with us holding hands. Right? Bing, bing, bing. That was our first TikTok, us holding hands. Oh, how far we've come. So I think the shipping, like, if anything, I feel like it started because of you. Mean. You're the originator of it. And there's no way you don't have a first impression, though. I feel like when you see like- someone... You have thoughts about them, you like. I think I was nervous when I first met you. I mean, because you didn't meet just me too. You met like all the. I met everyone, bro. So it was like, mm-hmm. whole freaking testosterone. What's it? What is? What is it called? Testosterone. Testosterone party. <laughs> like that's intimidating. It was like five dudes in a BNB. No. Mm. Literally. And then, so, I was a little intimidated. Valentina didn't know you were coming. No, I was a surprise. So how did you know we were there? It wasn't through Jago? Mm-hmm. Only Jago knew pretty much? Yeah. And no one told me that you guys were coming. So I was like, bruh. You know what I was thinking? I was thinking the first time. But I was like, damn, that's her. Like, what came to my head was like, what I said to your sister. Mm-hmm. That I was like, what's up with your sister? So I was like, now that I said that, I'm like, I'm actually gonna have to speak to her. <laughs> so I, I feel like I got a little nervous too. You see? Mm-hmm. I got a little nervous when I see you because I was like, damn, I was like, I was talking all this online, so I was like, now I gotta go now through with it. I have to face it. it. <laughs> I have to face reality. Yeah. But my first impression of her, I already told her I thought she was stuck up. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't like her. I didn't. <laughs> I seen her, I was like, she looked mad stuck up. Yeah. So, and he thought I was a B-I-T-C-H. I never said that. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. Hell no. Why did I say that? Maybe you didn't, but you thought it. I thought it exactly, <laughs> but I didn't say it. It's okay, bro. It's cause I've like, changed though. I've changed. The Valeria that I met is way different back then from now. Cause picture this, right? <laughs> this is a scenario, guys. I wake up like 1 p.m. I'm barely waking up, so I go to the living room, and then I think first thing I see is you walking into our BNB with a homegirl. Uh huh. First of all, like I know you. I was like, what, what's, who's this, bro? What, who's who is that? Yeah, like this is our personal space. You know what I mean? Like who is that? Like. <laughs> It just came out of nowhere. It just, I felt weird about that first. I get that. And then my lady came in walking like she's the shit. She came in with like a little vape in her hand. They hated the vape. I was looking at your at the time. I think I asked you for You did ask me. Even you and Jose. So I think I was the first one that initiated a conversation. Amazing. Probably. I think I think the first thing I asked was like, you smoke? <laughs> <laughs> I think that was actually. And then yeah, I was like, what flavor is that? And then I think when I actually like spoke to you, you were kind of nice. Yeah. You were like half nice, half. I would. I just had a wall. Yeah. This was her face the whole time, just. <laughs> but know, that's like, just my natural face. And it's because also I, f- I feel like me and the guys were in the living room just being funny, having the time of our lives, and then my lady was just in a corner with like a mean ass face. So I just felt comfortable, if I'm honest. 
Yeah. I mean, I get that. Hey, but our first conversation, I was just like, what flavor is that? Yeah. Like, I was like, what is it, like mango, peach, or something like that? Some weird thing. You don't even remember? <laughs> She's like, oh, it's mango peach. I was like, I'll try it. And then she just let me hit it. And then. That was boom. our first bonding moment. Boom, vaping back then. Yeah, back, back when we used to vape. I don't vape anymore. Me neither. And then you left it like a long time ago, yeah. too. So that was our first conversation. That's looking really funny, bro. That is. That's, that's, I think that's the funny way to. To start off, yeah. I don't. I still don't believe you. You don't have a first impression. I feel like you have a first impression. No. You know, you see me. You're like, oh, he's good looking. I'm like, oh, he's cute. No. Like, oh, he's attractive. Have you ever? Okay, let me ask you this. Have you ever thought that about any of the guys? Oh, right now. <laughs> <laughs> I can ask you that, <laughs> bro. It's, it's a normal question. You ever thought? Okay, about yeah, that? but I'm not gonna say who. But yeah, any hint? Uh -uh. Any like really vague hint? No. No, why'd you get so red again? I'll tell you, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you off camera. So when we tell you on the spot, you get all right. I know because I get nervous. Uh -huh. So it wasn't me though. It wasn't me. The yeah. first one we were like, that's crazy, bro. Bye, bro. Nah, it's okay, bro. It happens. <laughs> it happens. You thought that you was stuck up. Come on. Mm -hmm. I did. Hell yeah. yeah, I did. And then, when do we speak again from now? Did we leave off on a good turn? Yeah. That we were cool with each other and stuff. But then I, I don't remember what, what the next time I saw you was. I think the, the next time that we met after that was for... Okay, so we went from the BNB, right? And then the next time we met up from that, I think it was uh, December. Because I think y'all spent Christmas at our house. Oh, yeah, yeah, yes, yes. Y'all did, right? Yes, and I, I stayed at your house. Yeah, another thing too, bro. <laughs> what? Made me not like her even more. <laughs> What did I do? I'm like, I don't know this girl, and then she, like, they just... Oh, I stay at, my house, at your house. The whole, I think the whole family, right? Yeah. But, like, obviously, since you're, like, just a you girl can't blame my me. age... Oh. Like, I was, like, I would get more nervous around you. <laughs> like, your parents, I didn't mind staying at the house, but you, I was, like, it's just a girl that's my age. It's kind of... It is weird. weird. I know. I get it. And then we didn't know each other like that at yeah, all. Yeah, so we couldn't... We weren't comfortable with each other yet. And what did you think, what did you think of me at that time? Because well, me at that time was way different. Yeah, so, you weren't talking know. to any of us, bro. And you you kind of made me mad because I was like, bro, this is my only time that I can talk to him and bond with him. And you were just stuck in your room all day. Every single day that I was there, bro. Every and I was like, the day. only person I can hang out with is Ray. And he's in his room, not doing, not talking to any of us. Yeah. And I would bother him and be like, Ray, come on, Ray. <laughs> I'd be so annoyed, bro, because I didn't want to get He was going through it, too, so. But I was just trying to make him feel better, and it didn't work. So you tried to make me feel better, at least. Yeah, I tried to be a good person. What year was this? 2020? What? I think so. I think so, too. But I was like, when I went through, like, the worst depression ever, yeah. so. The whole, I think even on Christmas, like, and actual was Christmas winter. Eve, when we had to, like, exchange gifts, that's the only time I came out of my room. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and you got me. And presents. I gave him a present too. I didn't give you nothing. No, I, I didn't know y'all were bringing presents. Well, I'm just like that. I'm just a gift giver. Yeah, you, you and your whole family gave me a gift, and I didn't have nothing for anybody. But I was like, maybe this will make him feel better. It kind of did. I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you. But you know what always stuck with me though, like when we had a conversation. Uh, I think that's the only conversation we had that whole two weeks that y'all were at the house. Jacob was filming a video, and then I remember this. I didn't want this to happen, but I didn't want to talk to her, bro. I was so nervous at the time, but Jacob was driving to the studio and he could only fit Valentina in his car. Cause you had chairs. He had chairs in the back. Yes, I remember this. And then I had my car and he was like, obviously I have space in my car. So they were like, can you drive with Valeria? <laughs> and I'm talking about there's like a 40 minute drive, bro. So I'm like, I'm gonna have to talk to her for 40 minutes. So I personally didn't want to, you know? Okay. I was already depressed. I was already like, I didn't even like want to socialize. And then I was like, now I have to socialize for 40 minutes. And I socialize a lot, guys. What did we talk about on the way there? We talked about, with me. we talked about how I wasn't, I wasn't a Christian yet. <laughs> did we talk about like, we talked about like going out and like, um, did we plan on going oh, out? You know? Yeah, we did. We were like, we should go out sometime. <laughs> like, like just go out and party. And party, you know? yeah. <laughs> Valentina and Jacob were Christians. Oh yeah, they had already turned their life forward. And yeah. we hadn't yet. Mm -hmm. So I was like, you know, still in, in the party. life. Yeah, in that party life and stuff. But I remember we had like a whole talk on the way there. But it was like a deep like, conversation. 
It was deep. It's so crazy. Like a lot has changed since then. Like yeah. she was on a whole different path. I'm lucky still on the same path. Sadly, you feel me. But I we're, made we're some getting there. We're getting there. We're getting we're there. Getting there. <laughs> but was it called? We had a conversation on how like we wanted to change. We wanted to better ourselves. Like stop going out. Stop partying. Yeah. And then I feel like the next trip after that one, it was Miami. I think that was a whole year after. A year after. No. Yeah, yeah, that was. It a was. Year. But I always remember that because like a whole year after, like I had changed my life. I changed my life too. You what changed mean, before I changed, me. I changed before you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I turned my life over to Christ. You did. And then, like a couple months later, I think you were going through that same like change too. Yeah. And then that's when we like kind of like met up in Miami again, and we had both already been like converted or whatever. Yeah. So I was like, to me, to me, it always stuck to me because I was like, damn, we really had a conversation about that. And, like, a year ago. And a then, year ago. Oh. Like a year, year or some months ago. Mm -hmm. Right. Are Crazy. we talking about like right now? Mm -mm. A year before in Houston, yeah, we had a whole different conversation, and then we go back to Miami, and a whole year later, and we're completely different people. We were. So it was crazy. Like mm -hmm. literally, so much can happen in a year. Yeah, everything changed in that. Ever since you stayed. Miami was that. nice. I love Miami. I did love Miami. No. I met a lot of new people, a lot of your friends and stuff. Yeah. I love Miami so much. I want to go back. But yeah, that was our first impressions of each other. A whole hour <laughs> answer. <laughs> Wait, so I'm saying like a whole year already. All right, so like a year passed, right? We changed. Yeah. And then another year passed right now. And like, is there anything different with you? Mm, no. Or you think you just improved? I think I'm just, yeah, I've just improved more. You just got better? Yeah. That was such a long answer. It was. <laughs> but that was good because it was like a story tell. It was a Like story. people didn't know any of that. Next question. What is your biggest pet peeve of each other? I bet I already have one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already scared. Have one. I don't even got to think about it. I'm gonna let you go ahead and think of yours though. Cause you don't have yours apparently. Wait, wait, wait. There gotta be some I do where you're like, like that's annoying or like, ill. Is it, is it cussing? Nah. I know at first you, you didn't like when no. I would cuss a lot. Yeah, but I think I got used to it. You got used to it? I still feel weird when I cuss around you. Right? Cause you told I me to I feel weird, I'm like, <laughs> I feel like I'm sinning. <laughs> you told me to start cussing back then. Oh yeah, because I would hate you, right? Yeah, you're I, like, I said, that sounds nasty, like stop saying it. Like Yeah, I mean, I, I did, it is a pet peeve, but Not it's more of like a... Like it's doable or what? Yeah, it's like a, okay, like, I, it, it, I have to accept you, like, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? I, kinda, I, told yeah. him, I told him that if he, every time he would curse, that I would, I would hit him. And then and she he did. would, and I, yeah, he would curse and I would hit him. <laughs> Because, <laughs> bro, I just found that, like, nasty. Like, it's ugly when guys curse. It just looks out. Yeah. Good thing, like, you never cursed before. No. I'm not the same. Yeah. But now, when you every hear, time I hear, I'm like... <laughs> I'm like, oh. I'm not gonna lie, when I stopped cursing, it sounded weird to me, too. <laughs> when other people would do it, it would stand out since it wasn't part of my vocabulary. You see? Yeah. But well, now it's like... I would say that's my pet peeve of you. But also when you You didn't say nothing. You can say what I said. A pet peeve of mine is when you <laughs> that, that, you I don't even want you to say you it. You do this often. Every time like you like I don't know, like you just be doing nothing and you just like start screaming. I don't, I don't know. know that. Yes, I like, <laughs> like, oh, I'm like bruh. Every time. That's that's J. Cole's biggest pet peeve of mine. Really? Bro. That's why I'm like, I, I feel like you're more saying his than yours. No, it's every time. Because I do it around him. I don't, I don't ever recall. Every time I'm him. here, I always hear you screaming. I don't think you realize it, but you do. You do exactly it a lot. You know. I'm just like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> It's that one. Is when that, you, is, when is you do it, really, it like, is it really that bad? Like, when you do it, it once or twice, like, it's fine. I never do it more than once or oh, twice. Oh yes. You're then you just you just lose track of your of your. When's the of last time I ever did that? I don't, I don't even remember. It was because you noticed that you should. Know, on right? Sunday you did it. I didn't do that on Sunday. Oh. No, you for yeah, sure. I did you for lying. All right, bet I got mine too. I'm I got a list actually. All right, chill, bro. <laughs> How many do you want me to say? You say two. Well, two? You have more than three? Like what? I have four. I have four. Okay, say all four now, cause now <laughs> I want to know. <laughs> this is so messed up. <laughs> I don't have four, Go. bro. Okay. I don't have four. You have five? <laughs> <laughs> I got more than four. But we'll stick it with four, all right? Bruh. Okay, go. I might start crying, guys. <laughs> go, whatever you want. We'll finish it off right there. Then. <laughs> <laughs> when you start crying, it comes off. 
<laughs> All right, first, I hate when we're always just catching a vibe, being in the moment, doing what we're doing. And then this girl just, like, she'll just be on her phone the whole time, bro, zoned out on her phone. Like, what are you doing on your phone? And then I'll be bored. I'll be nosy sometimes. Like, what's she doing on her phone? Scrolling on Instagram, bro. That's all she does. Scroll on her feet. Okay, so I, I, like, could, I could read it to that one. That is I hate it. that because I feel like it kills my vibe. Okay, okay. I'm like, we're all vibing and you're not. It just kind of like It just ruins down. it, okay? It ruins it. Okay. I don't think you want me to name more than that. Though. No, I do. Go another one. Because that wasn't that bad. Because huh? I, I know I, I have to work on that. Like, I, I know I need to get off my phone. You do have to work on that. I know. Second, it's because not gonna lie, uh, I do it sometimes. Sorry, no, yeah, well, sorry about no, yeah, well, it's because I do it sometimes, like when I feel like awkward positions or just like I just feel uncomfortable. Most of the time, it's just you, me, Val, and Jacob watching a movie or playing a game, or then I either just don't want to watch the movie or I don't, don't want to play the game. <laughs> that kills the vibe of the movie, too. It makes me not want to watch the movie. Okay, fine, I'll, I'll be better. Bro. I think, second, you just be on your phone too much. That's it. There's times when like I'm gonna talk to a person, I want to talk to somebody, and then you're just there like with a mean red face on the couch <laughs> on your phone. I think this whole trip to North Carolina, that's mostly what you did. Uh uh. Yeah, bro, you were on the couch downstairs on your phone, and then but what, I was... two hours go by, right? I don't know. That's when you light up. You're like, oh man, let's go make a TikTok. <laughs> and then we make a TikTok. You're back to your phone all day, just there. No, like, bro. I'm not that bad, bro. You're that bad. Bro, North Carolina was sick. That's that why, was like, miserable. I feel like when I was at the house, I'm only talking to Valentina because well, Valentina's Valentina. She's always, you know, happy. Okay, one more. Second, um. Third. Oh, third. <laughs> you chew your gut too loud. Oh, <laughs> I knew you were going <laughs> to say that one, bro. You be smacking your teeth when you chew gum. Yeah, because we be like on the, on the car sometimes, all four of us. On the way somewhere, that's all you can hear, just you like <laughs> smacking your gum now. Like, just close your mouth. And you know what's crazy? I hate when people chew their gum. What? Like, when I can hear people chew their gum. And you do it? Yeah, but I didn't know I did. You can't hear your own little self. Like, no, I told mouth. you, I'm already half deaf. Is that actually true? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you need to stop chewing Bro, gum that, that, so loud. That's crazy. Do you want me to actually do another one? No, no, I'm done. I feel like the last one's the worst one. So. Okay, go. Nah, I was actually not. No, the worst one? Go, go. <laughs> I haven't taken a beating yet. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, you want to? <laughs> yeah, come on. Bring it to me. <laughs> no, I don't have a far one. Say? Oh, okay. But no, the, the chewing gum, I just made it up. I don't know. Recall your chewing gum that But you agree with me. I feel song. like I do, though, yeah. You probably do. I think Jacob has pointed it out before. <laughs> Alright, so we did biggest pet peeves. Let's do the opposite. Something that I like about you, something I like about me. Is that the opposite of pet peeve? Yeah. It's something you like. One yeah. thing you don't like about the person, one thing you like about the person. One thing I like about you, you always have gum on you. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I, I can ask you for gum when I need it. Or Vaseline. Oh, I always have Vaseline. And I always mm -hmm. give you Vaseline. That's but true. when I need something, I feel like you have it. So. That's true. Oh, sure. one thing I like about you is that when I have a good outfit on, you'll compliment it. Man, that's whack. It's true. <laughs> okay, that's another thing I like about you. I like how you dress. Hey. Yeah. All right, but now you. Wait, no, he talking. always wants to borrow my clothes, guys. I do. I feel like you throw good fits on. Yeah. And I wear baggy stuff. So they could so fit, it could fit him. Mm -hmm. All right, so next question came from ETTEVY7X. She asked, if y'all aren't together, would you get jealous if she starts dating someone vice versa would you get jealous if i start dating somebody what's so funny about that you want to go ahead and answer this would i get jealous would you get jealous if i started dating someone i 100 percent would not <laughs> you wouldn't even do some type of way mm. be like damn bro i think it'd be weird when you bring them around because of like the content that yeah. we made so i think that would be weird but you wouldn't feel jealous I wouldn't, I honestly wouldn't feel jealous. If he's not a good guy for you, then I'd feel some type of Okay. Guy, you know? I agree. I agree with that. Yeah. I wouldn't feel jealous, but if I know that she's not good for you, then I'd be like, all right, bro. Like, mm -hmm. like cut her off. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. So it's like. But I'd tell you. I'd yeah. tell you. So. so that's how I'd be feeling. Yeah. If, he was, if, if he's a good guy, I feel like. You, you would know, be happy. I would be happy yeah. for you, but if it's, if it's somebody not the that one, is not. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have problems. <laughs> we're gonna have problems. <laughs> no, I'm not doing shit. <laughs> I'm not intimidating nobody. No, but I get you. Yeah, so that's how I feel about it. Okay, me too. I agree. Okay, next question. 
Fitted Kev's underscore. He asked, who from Los Boys wouldn't you let date your daughter? <laughs> who, who wouldn't you let date your daughter? And who would you let date your daughter, actually? Hmm. I feel like I want to know both. But so you, can, you can answer this, too. Huh? It, you can answer this, too. And you know your friends better, so. Yeah, yeah, I only yeah, know a little bit. I want to know where your head's at first with that. Okay, in a way, I would let my daughter. Oh, actually. What? I have two people in mind. I would let my daughter date Kev. <laughs> for sure. For sure? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, for sure. Or maybe because I don't really know about Kev's stories. Nah, yeah, yeah, he's, he's a sweet but guy. But he's, he's a, a sweet, sweet guy, guy and he's very respectful. And then Yerohan. You let your daughter date Yerohan? Only, only because. That's crazy. Only because yeah. he's a lover boy. So I know he'd treat her. Mm. He would treat your daughter good? He would love my daughter good. You know what I mean? Mm -mm. Like because he's a lover boy, he'll show her like the affection, like he'll give her the, the okay, but I, didn't, I didn't expect that answer. Really? I did not expect that. Yeah. I thought you were saying me. Or not. I wouldn't be valid for your daughter. I mean you would, but... Why was it not there? Alright. You would date. I, have, I would give you permission to date my daughter, but that's weird. No, I mean this scenario is just like that picture of being a random girl. You have okay, a daughter, okay, okay. none of us know you, but you have a daughter, you know what I mean? And somehow you just found out all oh, those boys, you know? Like, you know nothing about it and say, oh, those boys. I'm still picking Kev first. Mm -hmm. And then I pick you. Nah, but you say yo. Well, yeah, but if, if you, you excluding me I was out excluding the you out the picture. Like, you're excluding me and Jago? Yeah. Like, what? Jago date my yeah. daughter? Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> You know what I mean? So I, <laughs> if you're in the picture though, I would include you and I'll put you second. So you're going based off of just Yero, Jose, Santi, Santi and Kev. And Kev. Yeah. And you said Yero. Uh, I said Kevin Yero. So I'm guessing Jose and Santi is who you wouldn't let your daughter date? Uh-uh. Why? I mean, Jose, <laughs> I don't really know. Jose's... Mm. I think you just don't know him. Like, yeah, I don't know him like that. And yeah, I don't know how he is with... Everybody. I don't know how he is with like, you know, his girl, so... Mm -hmm. But yeah, probably not Sandy either. Is there a reason? I don't really know a lot of his his girl story, so I mean he could be a good boyfriend, but I don't know. Yeah. How about you? Who would you not let your girl date? I mean, not your daughter date. Yeah. Who wouldn't you let? I wouldn't let my daughter date any of them. If you had to <laughs> say someone. That's a that's a complicated question. Just pick I don't one. Know. Who do you think is like the most? I pick Santi because he got the most money. Oh, right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, <Nah>, um, <laughs> bruh. Who would I actually pick? Uh, I think I'd pick. Um, you want your daughter to be a gold digger? Really? Nah, I don't. Yeah, I, 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 I take that back. I don't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't want any. Not even Kev. Like Kev is so sweet. I wouldn't let my daughter date Kev. I would not let my daughter date Kev. I would Yero? not let my daughter date Yero. Okay, so. I would not let my daughter date Santi. She's gonna have to. Be single her whole life. There were the only boys that existed on this earth, <laughs> and she wanted to find love. You wouldn't let her date any of them. She wouldn't find love with them though. All <laughs> right <laughs> now. <laughs> She's not finding love there. Just <laughs> you're making them seem so bad. They're, no, they're, they're not, not bad, bad, but I'm not picking them either. All right. Um. So more of the story. Don't let your daughter date anyone. <laughs> I wouldn't let my daughter date like any of my friends in general. Like even the off cam friends. None of them. I feel like I know too much about everyone to be like willing to, you know. All right, but I guess I'll go with. Uh, I th I think I think Santi's a sweetheart too. Okay. I think he could be a sweetheart with somebody he really cares about, you know. I think he's really giving too and caring, so I I'll go with Santi. Okay. Yeah, so that's my answer. I wouldn't want her to go with Santi, but but I, if you if there was no other option, it would yeah. Be Santi. Santi. Okay. I guess. All right, guys. Last and final question. Best question of the day. The most uncomfortable one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You already uncomfortable. Someone said you already got red. Red, red, red. Red. <laughs> I think I think it's like I just stop breathing uh -huh. when when things like that happen to me. I'm like, and I just get red. Okay. I think it's just if you get nervous in general. I feel no, like if I get nervous, I'm not nervous, my face gets red. I'm not nervous. It's just like when well, I you feel don't like, just stop breathing. Either. No, I promise you, I do. That doesn't make any sense. If you, you just breathe naturally. No, I oh like goodness. I was breathing. Yeah, I think like you're choking or something. No. Okay. Just ask what? the question. All right, this is why she's already. <laughs> and this is the last question, guys. 
In all seriousness, has the thought of YouTube being a thing crossed your mind? Ooh, has the thought of YouTube being a thing ever crossed your mind? Honest answer, no, guys. No. Disappointing, huh? Yeah. You no. guys probably thought you were going to hear a different answer, but I'm sorry to break it to you. No. We got too close together to the point where it's like, you know how you guys said that there was a question asked and I said that like, I would feel some type of way if a guy, like a bad guy, started dating her. Cause like, I feel like now I see her more as like, like a sister type of thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like we have that bond where it's like, I care about you, but I care about you as in, as, like, a, as family, as a, yeah. if that makes sense. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So like, yeah, I wouldn't want somebody bad for you. Cause I do Cause, care cause, still. Yeah. In a, in a family way, in a, in that caring way, not like a, oh, I'm jealous or like that. Like, that's not how, how it is. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to explain, but you're making me feel weird. <laughs> is it like a struggle to answer the question? No, but I agree. I, yeah, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, the thought of it never crossed our minds. Like we just yeah. got too close and it's like literally like brother and sister, like, yeah, like we just goof sister. around, you know, we just, we try to make it funny, but. I feel like we just got too close together. Yeah. To, and at the same time, also, it's like your, your sister's dating my brother, and then it's just, it makes everything weird. It does. Overall. Like, if we were to, like, if we were to date and then break up, we'd we still have to see each other. Yeah. Like, we'd have to take family trips <laughs> together. Y'all know how awkward that would be? So. That's so awkward, bro. And then, so, like, yeah. us taking other people, bro, mad awkward. So, so no. And yeah, as well as um, off camera. I've spoken to her about other other girls. girls? <laughs> I've spoken to her about other girls that I talked to and yeah, yeah, it's pretty much it. <laughs> <laughs> like you, no one talks about like girls that they go out with or guys that they go out with like with if, somebody if, they yeah like. with somebody that they like like <laughs> that's weird, bro. And, I feel like my lady knows too much. I do. And know that's too much. Like, on, I just like to rant sometimes, and she's like, I'm like the yeah that person lives. that you've been to. Yeah, so so. Pretty much it. Hey man, I feel like now I feel like it just ended all this. I know. Thing about, like, bro, You're right, bro. they watched this whole thing just to hear that. <laughs> just, just to be disappointed in that. Listen, y'all, we love you and we're still gonna make videos together. Oh uh, nah, yeah, we're you know, really good friends with each other. I think she's a fun person to be around and I like the friendship that we have. Yeah. If I'm being honest. So let me know actually though after the question we just answered let me know if y'all want to see her back on my channel if y'all never want to see this face again like, <laughs> let me know this might be the last time i've been with her real. Okay. <laughs> but y'all might see me on her channel way more are we still filming for you after this yeah all right guys uh we're gonna film for her by the way right after this so if you want to go see that it's gonna be in her channel what is it gonna be Valeria Canas. No, I mean, like, what's the video gonna be? I don't know yet. We're still deciding, but it'll be on her channel. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much for uh, introducing me to Colombian food. food. We'll do a part two if you guys want to see with Honduran food. Yeah. Comment down below and I'll show up. If y'all want to see, because, you know, we're still going to debate in the comments more or less Valeria. Let me know. More, more, more Valeria. More. Either more Valeria or no Valeria at all. Hey! So, comments gonna have to decide. More no. <laughs> more no, more no. That's been it for the video. God bless you guys. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Peace.